guys and welcome back to my channel. We're watching some more One Piece today. You guys, I am catching up and it's kind of like a like a big deal because you know you started off with having to watch a whole what almost 800 episodes at the time. So it's like now now it's 900 I think. Like 900 episodes you have to catch up on. And it's like you're rearing very close to it and it's like Dang, I came a long way. <laughs> and it's like kind of sad now because I'm so used to binging, wanting to see the next episode. And here I am eventually going to have to wait weekly. And I don't know how I feel about that. <laughs> but anyways, um, we're going to continue going. Um, we left off just completing the whole reverie arc in the last reaction. Um, thanks to Seth for the edits. But we're going to continue doing the original way this, you know, going forward. So, yeah. Um, we got a lot of good tea. We saw Shanks meeting the Gorose, which is like, why are you talking to them? And what part are you actually referring to? Are you talking about Luffy? Is there somebody else you want to talk about, like Blackbeard or something? And um, we also was introduced to Imusama. Imusama is, to me, I honestly feel like it looks like the, the higher, um, uh, entity of the Celestial Dragons of the world government who is basically the one that is moving the chess pieces. The Gorose had actually went and spoke to Imsama and had asked him or she or whoever it could be who or whose light needs to be diminished. Okay, I saw that Shirohoshi had the sword in her head and then we had Blackbeard and then we also had Luffy's pictures torn right beside it, but he did leave off with Vivi's picture. When I kind of understood, well, what I kind of got from that scene was how, um, I believe, the, was it Nefertari family was supposed to be a celestial dragon, but they denounced themselves as being so, so they came back to the regular world with the regular folks and just decided to be kings, okay, and royalty, basically. So I, to me, it's like I feel as if since they were probably one of the original families, maybe Im Sama's like, wanting to hush them up. There's probably something that they know and Im Sama does not want them to spit it out in the world to find out. Because it seems as if Im Sama has been around for a very long time. Well, that's just for me because they're asking him from right, you know, jump, whose light do we need to diminish this time? Unless they're referring to um, Roger, but still, I don't know. It just seems like he's been around. Well, he or she has been around for a while. So wouldn't it be kind of like, I don't know, maybe I'm reaching that he's been around for since the beginning, like since the voice century actually happens, and he actually knows the full story of exactly what happens, what happened, and he doesn't want anybody to know. That's what I'm getting, and that's how I, my theory is so far. But yeah, hopefully we're going to get back into the story. Hopefully we're going to see um, more of the other side of the crew because we saw a lot of you know Sanji and Luffy and them so hopefully we get to see somebody else without further ado let us go ahead and jump on in it's some more One Piece let's go it's Whitebeard I wonder why Whitebeard never had any kids of his own or does he have any those were the, the, the guardians while they were younger. Wasn't his name Blackback or something? <laughs> no, why do they look different? <laughs> They're the same age. Never mind. I guess they are peace. Wasn't the lion f from Impel Down? Oh, he's healing him. Former first division. So what is he now if he's a former? Who took control? Oh. Right. Mythical. Mm. 
this freaking double fruit was awesome. I still don't, I don't know, man. Like, why would you listen to an enemy? Like, I don't know, man, Squark. And then Whitebeard being a true father gave him a hug. I think I was like, what the hell? <laughs> Exactly. <laughs> yeah, for like two minutes. And then guess what? I kind of came. <laughs> That's what happened. For him to be like the first Yonko, not the first Yonko, but I mean, like the first Yonko that we've seen, that we actually seen kind of do his moves and fight, because we were introduced to Shanks, but I we never seen Shanks go full blown out. And seeing Whitebeard go, compared to Big Mom, or even Kaido, it's like, I don't know, man. I wish I would have been able to see him more so in his prime than when he was older. If a Blackbeard is still his devil fruit power is so beyond me. Okay, so I have another theory. Like, what if Teach, since he is a D, um, no information dealing with folks who have D in their names. Maybe the ability is not so much his 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 um, special ability or health issue thing that Marco was referring to, but it has something to do with the D. And probably maybe people with D in their names can have the ability to have more than one double fruit. What happened to that guy? He got beat up real bad. He got beat up by Luffy? No. He just wanted a family. Yo, my heart hurts. I don't like watching, getting flashbacks about all this. Even though it wasn't just Blackbeard that kind of like fought him, like, Whitebeard was fighting everybody. I'm gonna put on a show. How did he know? Maybe it does have something to do with his devil fruit since he was looking for this devil fruit power for the longest time. Or maybe his devil fruit power is needed for something bigger than just um, taking people's devil fruit. Blackbeard is still such a mystery.
Yeah, I don't know. I don't think it's nothing to do with his devil fruit giving him the ability to possess um, multiple devil fruits. It's something else. He looks so good. You know what I'm saying? I heard like he's older, but he doesn't look like he's old. Oh, wow. Oh, really? Oh my gosh, white beard. Wow. Wow. <gasps> With even Marco being as strong as he is, couldn't do nothing. Was Teach f uh, fighting by himself? Wow. Shoot, I'm with you. Stingy. <laughs> Those are probably all the good things he's all oh, looking at go my mushy trying to offer comfort. I don't think Shanks um is bad. I don't know. I just feel like Shanks knows something. If One Piece had a Mori, <laughs> I would love to see an episode of that. Are you the daddy? He ain't got no fortune. Hold on, so they're part of the same crew. What if all of them were on the um, Rocks Pirates together? Like, say, Big Mom, White Beard, um, Kaido at one point. I would love to know who the Rocks Captain was. Look, Marco was about to choke. I know, and, and the thing is, Whitebeard has said to protect Luffy. I know Marco's been like, gosh dang it, this kid just keeps throwing himself into trouble. I know, I would be like that. <laughs> Only they knew what happened to Shido Hoshi. Cry baby. <laughs> what sign are you looking at? <laughs> oh, now he's about to hit him. Big Mom and Kaido are on the paper. They already put it in the paper that they're going to team up. I hope they read that part. Brooke, rude. You don't even know the girl. <laughs> Booty tooted up, ain't it? It's not him they talking about. Oh, it's the doctor! I oh, know he's so happy to see her. It's like his mom. <laughs> he's 
cutting her picture out to have it. They took out the pictures of Big Mama Kaida. So they don't have no idea that Big Mom and Kaido are going to be in one spot when they arrive to Wano. <sighs> They're not even from there. You just want to pop up at their spot? No, boy. Yeah, I'll call. I'm sorry, Luffy. You best to call them to make sure everything's okay before you just sell your ass into craziness. And Momo talking about how he met Roger is kind of eyebrow raising he know he ain't gonna take no Kaido head Kaido is a freaking monster a monster is that an octopus that's nasty nope yeah it feels like doesn't it feel like everything seems brighter? Like the animation just kicked up a bunch. Like the effects is, seems a lot better. Like look at the water. Oh heck no! <laughs> Yo, all it would take for me to turn my ass around and see that thing standing there. Mm -mm. I know Luffy asked. He looking. He can see that dang on octopus. Basically, is what he's saying. What is? What is? <laughs> Look at Chopper! What is it doing? What is its purpose? Look, I don't even care! Wait, you octopus. What is it doing? Oh, it's talking to animals. Lord Jesus, talking to animals. It's like taiko drums. Oh no, it's coming! It's a huge carp! What in the heck is this freaking octopus up to? Why is he making the fish jump? They're monster carp anyway! <laughs> I knew in my head that he was going to think about eating them. But I was like, carp? You don't want to eat a carp. They're cute. They're so cute, no! <laughs> Karen! <laughs> Poor Nami. That's cool. It's like an art piece. Like a painting. I love it. I freaking love this. He's riding off. 
fish. Mm -hmm. Oh, that is beautiful. Baby fishes. Then a river? Where are they going? Are they going? Is Luffy still around here? Oh, he'll be all right, you said. It looks like a dancing octopus. They are swimming up a freaking waterfall. Of course we will. What do you mean? Oh gosh. Count on Luffy. <laughs> I gotta be kidding. <laughs> Y'all better hold on to something. Luffy is so reckless. But hey, it works. Only Luffy would think of something like that. Poor Chopper. <laughs> Like <laughs> She's all excited and Chopper looks like he's in pain. <laughs> Look at Nami's eyes. Yo, I love this. Oh, only Luffy. You know, knowing Luffy, he probably talked to the dang on fish while he was riding on him. Mm. It was fun, wasn't it? <laughs> I thought I was going to die. <laughs> So basically, the octopus helped them get to the land of Wano. So the octopus may not be bad. <laughs> Try and look, down. of course, Luffy is smiling. No, they're my dinner. Did she do instant transmission on Luffy? <laughs> no, me. <laughs> See, look, Nami must have some secret powers that only she can uh, activate when she gets pissed. <laughs> oh, now he worried. Oh, now he's worried. It's going to be a long way to go in the water. It's like a toilet. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> Oh, Luffy's sinking. So did the, the boat crashed or something? How did he get off the boat? So the octopus is back in the water. Oh, but it's fresh water, right? Or any water in general will mess up Luffy. He is drowning. Who's going to help him? This is the Wano. Okay. This is the ninja Wano world. Kuni. This is the ninja world? Yeah, this is the ninja world. Isn't this exciting? Mm -hmm. this is is this my baby? Is this my boo? Udo. It is my son! I miss you so much! I just want to run into the screen and knock out. He has a bun! I don't know if I like him with a bun. So hold on, they, never, they haven't crossed paths with Kaido or none of the men yet? Frankie? That's why he got nails in his nose. Why got Ew, is that snot? Why do you got nails in the swamp too? It's nasty. Frenosuke, a carpenter. A noted sword.
This is simple math. That is so simple. He's a salesman. Why did he cut his own arm? Is that real? Is that real? He won them fake salesmen. Robin. She's not a geisha, is she? Is she a geisha? We're trying to get her ready for marriage or something? Cheap it up, baby. <laughs> Look how pretty Robin is. Ah, she's a geisha. I was right. Zoro Juro. Oroni. Zoro Juro. And it makes me sick. <gasps> what? No! It's not him. Orochi. Swords become stronger. But it's not him. It's not him. Seppuku. Oh, no, 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 no. That's when you're going to die by the sword, right? Sorojuro. <laughs> What's up? Oh, I freaking like the transition, baby. I love it. I love it. The transition is bomb. They all look the same, don't it? They must be family. A grave robber. Oh, damn it. It wasn't him. And then he has it. Exactly, he's not. Is he the slasher? Is he the real slasher? Because he made a point to say the blood on the blade or something like that makes it stronger.
blessing the sword. Farewell. Was that a dream? No. I wish it is. That's not a dream. Look at that ab work, though. He ain't gonna do it, is he? Is he gonna do it? No! Oh. I smell blood. I, I called it. He's a slasher. How is he able to do that with the... He, yo, Zorro, ain't no grip on it, but guess what? He made it work. He may do it, what it do. He went against this roll. Movie got lucky. He freaking, oh, so that the Sunny did um, collapse. <laughs> He's like, wake up. But where's everybody? What about Chopper and Brooke? There's double foot users as well. It's the straw hat. Straw hat? Where's those guys at? Mm -hmm. oh, yeah. Everyone fight him. Dang, Zoro! Look at my. I mean, yeah, it's kind of bad that there's blood and stuff, but Zoro is doing it. Yo, look at the. I swear. I'm loving this different art style. It seems like it's different. What the world? A shishi dog? That's a shishi dog. He said, what the? Alright, you guys. So, I am really excited to see what's going to go on in this next arc. Um, Zoro, of course, is making a big scene, just opening, you know, we just, he just, we just got introduced to him, and it's like, he's just going on fast forward. I don't really understand on how they kind of, like, targeted Zoro when, you know, he obviously was not the slasher, and they kind of just say, oh, you're him, you're the slasher, and then expect him to go down without a fight. You know what I'm saying? I mean, he did try at least, um, but it does seem as if all the, sh the, the crew members of the Straw Hats have different roles that Tanjiro had given to them. Of course, we see Zoro's not really abiding by it. I know Frankie's having a hard time. Robin seems like she's under some type of stress, but Usopp seems like he's kind of like coping with his, um, his role. But I'm really excited to see exactly how everybody's been kind of like carrying on since they've been in Wano. Um, we only seen Luffy. We haven't seen Brooke, um, Chopper, Sanji, or Nami, and I'm kind of worried because Luffy did get kind of lucky to wash up on shore. So hopefully the other Straw Hats wash up on shore. But I know Chopper and Brooke are Devil Fruit users, so I don't know how that's gonna go. Um, also, when they said it was like fresh water, I have a question: Is it water in general that paralyzes Devil Fruit users, or is it like salt sea water that paralyzes um, Devil Fruit users? This is a question that I need to understand because I don't think I've ever asked it and got an answer from it. So, um, yeah, this is really exciting. I am so happy to be going into this with my Blue Zoro in this arc, and I'm so excited. I just missed him so much. And y'all, he... Okay, I did have like a little Zoro fangirl moment. Like when he touched his stomach, it was like, bloop, bloop, bloop. I was like, hey. Uh, in my head, I heard Mariah touch my body. <laughs> Uh, anyways, um, thank you guys for watching this reaction with me, and I will catch you guys in the next one. Peace.